Everybody talks about protein and amino acids and why they're so critical for the body, but guess what's more important than protein and amino acids? Minerals. Minerals are the most important of all because they are cofactors for plenty of enzymatic reactions that make the body function normally. So for example, your digestive enzymes, you know, the plenty of other enzymes in the body that are necessary for energy, energy production, healing, etc. These things all require minerals. They all re require your magnesium, your zinc, your selenium, your trace minerals. These things are all critical. So if you're trying to go ahead and, and get more and more and more protein, oh, I got to get more protein, got to get more amino acids. This is what I need to be healthy. Guess what? It's not true. Too many amino acids, too much protein that doesn't reach the cell, causes more stress in the kidneys, more stress in the liver. This taxes the body. Instead, on the other side, you can actually restore your detox system by eating plenty of plants that have minerals in them. Your kale, your Swiss chard, you know, your other greens, your, your um, collard greens, etc. You know, those all have plenty of minerals in them. Other plants, even apples, vegetables, anything that's a plant typically has minerals in it. And you want to have a diversity of these because when you have diversity of minerals, or diversity of plants, you have a diversity of minerals, you have a diversity of fibers, you have a diversity of nutrients, etc. So if you're trying to go ahead and get healthy, the answer is not going to be more protein. It's not going to be more amino acids. These things often feed viruses. They often feed pathogens as well. If you want to be able to get healthy, you got to get more fiber, more minerals. So how do you get your minerals? How do you get healthy from minerals, right? Well, you get plant-based minerals, plant-based mineral supplements. For example, marine algae contains uh, magnesium. You can get a plant-derived magnesium from marine algae. One, for example, there's one called, uh, by nature's answer is the brand, and it's called marine-based magnesium, okay? There is a, uh, there's a plant-derived zinc from guava plant uh, that's from tri Triquetra. There is a, you know, a plant-derived selenium that's from garlic that's from Triquetra, you know? There's a uh, plant-derived trace mineral that's from Swanson called sea minerals that's derived from marine algae. That is all the trace minerals, you know? You get your trace minerals from fulvic acid, humic acid as well. These things all contain minerals and they're critical to your overall cellular health, your enzyme production, and just your overall digestion and well-being. Also, minerals help to get rid of toxins out of the body because they bind to the receptors that the heavy metals would, and the toxins would, so they prevent them from binding to the receptors, and this is very critical. And uh, in addition, minerals help their cofactors to detoxification enzyme productions, things like zinc, things like uh, magnesium, things like trace minerals. They actually increase their own, your own production of glutathione and other detoxification enzymes. So this is why minerals are so much more important than amino acids. Amino acids are critical, yeah, but you don't need as many as people say. And if you have a diet that's high in protein, low in minerals, you're eventually not going to be healthy. If you have a, a diet that's high in minerals and low in protein, you will be healthy. Take it from me. I did it for years. I lived primarily off of plants, mostly a high mineral diet, high plant, high fiber diet, lower in protein that help my body heal. You can't heal from excess protein and animal products and excess amino acids. Puts too much stress on the liver, the kidneys, the lymph system. You gotta get the minerals to get your natural detox flowing right and alkalize your body because that's what the minerals do is they alkalize your body. They keep it from being too acidic. While on the other hand, if you got protein you're consuming all the time and too many amino acids, they over acidify the body and this causes problems. So thanks for watching everybody. Go to my website, nsickness.org. I get hundreds of articles, hundreds of videos on there teaching you how to heal yourself. Take care.